はい、みなさん、こんにちは。大元気ですかどうも、ハルです。And today's video, I'll be showcasing the Saitama apartment, or more specifically, Saitama's apartment room, I guess. Not sure what to call it. It'll be, of course, in the title below. So,、uh, of course, this is from One Punch Man, if you guys haven't seen or heard of the anime.、Uh, I believe it's only like two seasons.、Uh, This actually took a while trying to find where actually Saitama lived in his apartment. Because originally I built it second floor all the way to the right. And then I saw another picture from the anime that was on the third floor, so I just assumed he lived on the right side. So I built it up here. But then I just wanted to go more in depth and just see what. Or where his exact、uh, apartment is pinpointed in the apartment. And I believe it's episode two where he was trying to kill the mosquito outside his,、uh, his balcony or whatnot.、Uh, yeah, he was watering his cactus right here. And、uh, I believe there's a shot outside, maybe. I don't know if I have the picture screenshotted or whatnot on my computer. I might pop it up right here or right now. Maybe not. I don't know. <laughs> But. It was,、uh, it was right here, and it showed both of the sides of the apartment, and then he lived in the middle. Of course, there's other shots from the side right here that showed、uh, like these barriers or the walls that kind of separate the、uh, apartments. And there were three exactly, so I'm assuming, yeah, he did live in the middle part.、Uh, also, just a heads up, I guess I should have said in the beginning of the video.、Uh, This video, of course, might be short just because I'm going to be showcasing his room only.、Uh, so, yeah, let's head up there now. Second floor.、Uh, none of the rooms are really filled. It's just like the other buildings I have in my anime world, where if you guys like, join it or any of my friends are on the server, like, you can claim one of these rooms. I don't really care. But, uh,. So far, we have a couple rooms occupied by some of my friends. So, yeah. Anyways, let's walk in right here, which I already am.、Uh, pretty mellow gel feeling as soon as you walk in.、Uh, right here, this is where you put your umbrellas and whatnot.、Uh, shoe rack. I don't believe they showed this hallway at all. I just kind of referenced pictures from the actual Saitama apartments in Japan and the anime. Well, I guess. In the anime, it is located in Japan also, but in the,、uh, you know, there's just monsters roaming around and superheroes. So, over here to the right is the restroom.、Uh, I don't believe they show the restroom in the anime.、Uh, I honestly don't remember.、Uh, I just got it off the Saitama apartments because they are very similar to each other from the anime to reality. So, you got your bidet toilets, those are way better than the ones here in America. They're Goddamn low. Well, especially in California, they're, they're low flow, but <laughs> they suck. Rather, you can't go back once you use a bidet.、Uh, over here is the kitchen. I believe there's a shot when Genos was walking by. I don't remember what episode. Could be five, six. I don't know. I'll probably put a pop up message right here what episode it was in. So, it showed right here where Saitama was cooking. I forgot the, the, the monster also, but she looked like kelp or seaweed. You know, Genos was walking by, I saw Saitama cooking right here, and then I, I forgot the specific lines, but they were saying, like, I don't think we need any more seaweed or kelp anymore. I don't know who eats kelp, I think that's just like part of the sea, but I, I'm assuming it's seaweed now.、Uh, yeah, pretty typical kitchen, I guess. Pretty small, not too bad. Oh man, I forgot to. Forgot. Uh oh. Oh yeah, I, I can't even. <laughs> I don't think I can place any more signs just because I ran out to make in the world. They need to increase that in, in the next update, hopefully. So yeah, that was the kitchen. And then the, the room itself that shows mostly in the anime, or his room that shows in the anime. Most of the time is right here.、Uh, yeah, I rolled up his bed right here. I put the. I used snow. I don't know what you would call them. Just like flat snow, I guess. Or just snow blocks. Not snow blocks. I don't know.、Uh, 
Uh, yeah, they're just flat right there. I doubled up, so it looks like pillows. Uh, the bookshelf is supposed to represent his manga collection. Uh, the clock right there is supposed to be this alarm clock on the ground. Uh, I believe he had like action figures, that's why I put a Steve head. I don't know why I put a potted plant right there. Of course, the, the cactus out there. Uh, the TV where he watches the news just to see if there's any crime going on or any monsters attacking, then he'll come and save the day. And uh, I think a, a lot of people take credit from him, if I remember correctly. I know they don't ever call him One Punch Man. Like I think he brings it up that he wants to be called One Punch Man, but he no one ever calls him that. Uh, the desk with his laptop, I believe, and the desktop. Yeah, he does have a laptop and a tower for some reason. Like it's not a actual uh, monitor itself, but whatever. <laughs> uh, the table, table where they eat at. Sorry, my bad, guys. Something just happened to my recording. But anyways. Uh, yeah, I already showed you here, and the armor is in this closet right here. You know, the gold, gold armor, and the dyed red boots. I believe, uh, I don't remember if there's actual, um, where is it? Is there a white cape at all? I don't remember if, oh yeah, I think his cape is white. No, these guys have red and whatnot. I don't know, I felt like he wore a red cape also just because he had red boots well at least in the anime he wears a white cape question mark no I, I think he does I'm pretty sure so uh, I guess that is it for the showcase build uh, not much to show of course since he does live in a very small apartment uh, I guess I'll show you the other this is the first version I did I had to remake this apartment again just because when I was looking back at the anime again it was you know it was it didn't feel right and over here see the kitchen you can already tell the difference that because I thought the closet was this big right here until I looked at episode 2 again where he was putting water into his little elephant uh, watering thingamabobber and uh, yeah the kitchen is like this so then I moved or I made the kitchen bigger, I moved over some blocks. Uh, yeah, the the uh, closet is over here now, exactly where the armor is supposed to be. I just made it straight, and then the window is supposed to be here. So this is the original uh, design I had until I, you know, put more research into how the apartment looks like in the anime. So yeah, I'm glad I actually went back to get a more accurate look of the build. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I don't know what else showcase to show f like after. I'm not done with a couple. I guess I can show a few. This one is the Sawada house from or S Suwa Sawada house or Suna's house from uh, Kitekyo Hitman Reborn. Of course, if you don't know what this is, then why even watch the anime? <laughs> It's, uh, well, it's not her apartment entirely. It's just, you know, this is where Lucy Hartfilia lives. I believe her room is down on the right right there. But, uh, yeah, it's not done. No interiors are finished. I need to add more windows and whatnot. Uh, from Hataraku Mausama is the McRonald's. <laughs> I believe I'm almost done with this. I just need to fix the second floor. I need to add some desks and whatnot. Uh, let's see, my fairy tale guild is actually down over there, which I'm not going to show yet because it's incomplete entirely. Well, like, it's not presentable, at least for in my eyes. Uh, over here I have it in another save. Uh, it's supposed to be, there's roads actually going over there, a road going over here, pretty far out. I do have uh, an anime build here. And here, this one I, I guess I can save. Like, where I'm standing right now is the uh, Assassination Classroom School. Uh, this one, I think, is pretty much done on the other save. This one right here is the Kawaii Complex from... I forget the name, I put it right here. Bokura wa Mina Kawaiso. So yeah, this place right here. It's not done yet. I do need to finish interiors and add all the foliage and... 
the natural and all that good stuff. I do want to move the Kame House also into its own island just because I mean a lot of my friends said that it should be in its own uh, like, you know theme its own environment just because like how I built the forest home from Sal has its own environment look uh, same thing for I forget her name Mio Akiyama uh, yeah, pretty much you get the idea. So anyways, again, uh, for like the third time, maybe. I don't even remember saying it. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Jane, ciao, guys.